The following video is rated PG, which may contain material that is unsuitable for younger viewers. What's up everyone? Sorry if we're doing this episode a day late. We got too busy with other stuff. Dude, this show is unscheduled. It doesn't matter when an episode airs. Whatever. Anyway. Sorry to interrupt, but the ERA government has announced changes. Already? We only just started, and then the stupid ERA government business returns to annoy us. Don't tell me it's about the lags again. Unfortunately, it is. As a result of the extreme lags, this podcast cannot continue, and it must be suspended. Suspended? What the hell are you talking about? We've spent nearly a year on this podcast. We are not leaving it behind. But you have to. You can't decrease the lags as long as the error government exists. Then what are we supposed to do? We can't go back to using plushies again. Well, sorry. There are no other options. You know what? Screw it. We'll just use another podcast studio then. Ha. Huh. How about now, peasant? Hey. What are you doing? You're not supposed to use another podcast studio as a method to destroy the lags. That's cheating. Well, sorry. Bad luck. You know what? Fine. Do whatever the hell you want. I give up. Anyway. We just made one of the greatest discoveries since the first photo of the black hole in 2019. Let me explain. So basically, someone managed to find what we believe is an early prototype of the infamous Class Geek Supposplat logo. And no, this is not fake. This is the photo we managed to obtain. This was from the Animation Magazine back in 1996, two years before this logo officially debuted, according to someone on Twitter. Whoa. So it does look real. How did anyone else not realize that? Well, it's obviously the same Splat that we all know, but his face was overlapping for whatever reason El Mal. But if you look closely at this speech bubble, you can see that Splat is thinking about, well, something. Saving, writing, cutting, blowing up and killing someone. I don't know. If this logo was on TV, that would be more interesting. Nah, logo kids would say it's fake. Not like this one. Dude. Where the heck did you get that? Oh, it's no big deal. I managed to steal all the mushrooms that Mario has been hiding in his basement, so I'm gonna eat one of them and become bigger and bigger like him. Bro, don't eat that. You hallucinate! Hallucinate, huh? As if- No, 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 no. Well, what do you know? That did nothing- He's President Mushrooming Mushrooms. Oh my god. What the hell did I just eat? See Ninja Menu? Fujitsu. Susie. Sook. Some women sook. Foda Ralph swings me rap passes him of our suck on her McNap. Wait, Kalamba. Sorry I had to put that in there. We had to cut off the rest of the scene, because Chuck went on shrooms and has gone severely out of control. We managed to sedate him, but he quickly recovered from his hallucinations. Anyway, back to the show. Man, I can't believe I had to eat that. That was the dumbest mistake I made in my life. Yeah, you can say that again. Hi guys. Sorry, have I come to the wrong place? Uh, who the hell are you? I was looking for a nightclub to hang out with someone, but I must have been mistaken. 
Who is this woman, who invited her here? Let me guess, is Travis up to his schemes again? Wait, who's Travis? Dude, forget Travis. Just tell us why you're here and get out. Oh, didn't I tell you? I'm Red's secret girlfriend. Wait, what? Excuse me? Yeah, Red and I have been dating for some weeks now, and I think we've been getting along okay. Well, bye, Red. It's been nice knowing you. Is this true, Red? Did you sleep with that woman? Stella, let me explain. You've been flirting with her this whole time? You've been shagging up with her and put me last. What kind of husband are you? But you don't understand. She is setting me up. She wants to break us up, but it's not my fault I destroyed my own marriage. Of course it was your fault. And guess what? You're right. We are so going to have a divorce, and I don't even want to look at you anymore. Goodbye Red, and enjoy your life with your new girlfriend. Well, that didn't end well.